I'm Patty, and uh, my role, I'm the breakfast chef, I'm the, I'm the early one, and I've, this is my 19th year. I get here about 20 to 4, and I've never got here to bed and think, oh, I don't want to go. Come in work and get do all my, get all my pots and pans ready. The guests start coming in about half past six. It is a special place. As I say, it's home from home for me. As long as I can make them happy, I'm happy. So my average day would be um, kind of coming in, checking the arrivals for that day. Um, we look at our arrivals coming in uh, quite a few days in advance. The team will be booking those reservations in, but I will be looking at what's coming in and how it fits within the business, making sure that the clients get what they're expecting. At the moment, I'm six months into a management development programme. Um, so from someone like myself, I'm based in the office, so I don't often get to see the operational side of things and kind of decisions that are made in advance of it getting to me. Um, so for instance, at the moment today I've been on a training course for um, sales, so it's kind of looking at how the business comes into the hotel um, and the client's perspective is what they're expecting out of the hotel. Um, so it's quite interesting to kind of take that on board and see how everyone connects as a team to kind of get to that end result. It makes it a lot easier for you as um, somebody that's selling the property to have something that is up to date, um, a really good product and to be proud of the product. My name's Lee, I work at the Running Media on Thames Hotel. I've been here for almost two years now. I'm a personal trainer, recently just qualified. Um, I started here as a fitness instructor and I got training through the company to become level three personal trainer. I'm really enjoying it at the moment. We've got a great team, um, really happy. Uh, so being a personal trainer at the Running Mead, um, we have over a thousand members. Um, we see quite a lot of them regularly. Uh, they come in every day. Um, we help them with their programs, inductions, uh, any training that they want. So in our team we have currently eight people. Um, we all get on really well. We're all friends outside of work as well as inside of work. My name is Anna. I work in a lounge as a deputy lounge manager. I started as a waitress in Lab Bank restaurant and then um, I, I got promoted to be a team leader after two years and then uh, I applied to assistant manager position in the lounge and this is how it started, working in the lounge for the last two years. I really love working in the lounge, every day is a different experience. You can't really get bored. When you start talking to customers and when you, when you start talking to, to your team, your English is improving a lot and I, and I feel so much more confident. I love working with people and I have to say I have an excellent team. It's very important that we all have a really good connection as well, so we, do, we are like family. Uh, so my name is Jess, I work for the Meeting and Events Guest Services team. So my role is just looking after the guests throughout the day, doing their conferencing. Um, so originally my mum started off here, she's been here for about 20 years and I started here just as a casual position as a lifeguard in the spa. Um, I was a student at the time and I did my qualification through the hotel, they sponsored me to do it. And then since then I left education and then I came full time in events. One of the perks of working here is that once you've been here a while you can uh, stay at our sister hotels which is the Grove and the Athenaeum. All the hotels are quite different to one another so it's quite nice to see. So I would definitely recommend um, the hotel to anyone who is looking for work or any of my friends. Um, yeah, it's a great place to work. I'm Gary, I work at Runnymede on Thames. I'm a team leader there and I've been working in the left bank for about nine months and my general role is to assist with the manager in the day-to-day -day running of the restaurant and make sure everything goes accordingly. Other duties are manage the restaurant when there's no manager on duty as well, so there's a bit more responsibility there than just your standard waiter. But the thing I like about the place, it's a very sort of family orientated unit within the staff and things, and we're all very um, close knit as well. A lot more job security than I used to have. I've been, I'm a lot better off in the three years that I've been here, in the 10, 12 years that I was out doing landscaping and groundwork. So, so yeah, so it has its perks. <laughs> My name's Jimmy, um, I work in the guest relations team and I've been working here for seven years. 
a bit about the guest relations. Um, I suppose we're the, the tourist part of the hotel. Uh, we help out a lot of leisure guests um, if they want to go uh, into London or if they need to get a train, uh, a bus, anywhere in, in the UK, I guess. I'm a qualified skipper. I do take out uh, the running meet or the Antara 66. That's if, again, you can do it self-drive. If you're nervous or if you just want to lay back and, and enjoy the ride, then a skipper will definitely, it's definitely a good thing to do. Uh, if I could be on the Thames all day, I would. So. With the team, yeah, there's definitely a team mentality. Because of the way the management look after you, you, you do feel like family uh, with everyone here. It's definitely down to respect. Um, you always, if you want respect, you need to, you need to give it. Um, that's, that's vice versa, that not just coming from the management, it's coming from us. If we want respect, then we've got to earn it. Everyone in the hotel are all friends with each other. They're more than happy to go out and have a drink with each other. So life just doesn't end here.